Hello everyone, my name is Petro and in this video I'm going to be showing you a digital auto range multimeter from Parkside. This specific one I bought from Lidl, I paid £9.99 for it, but you should be able to buy it from other online retailers such as eBay or Amazon. But of course Lidl will have the advantage of selling this cheaper compared to any retailer out there. So what I'm going to do, uh, to do first is show you the information on the packaging and of course uh, show you the product itself. So let's get started. This is the packaging the product comes with. Uh, it feels very solid and very sturdy. Very simple packaging. Now this is the product itself uh, and the, the, the accessories that come with it. So what I'm going to do is zoom in the information on the packaging. On the top right we can see that this one comes with three years warranty. Uh, some further technical information here and also the battery is included as well and that's the information at the front now on the back of course you can pause at any time to read the, the, the information uh, on the back And that's it, pretty much the information on the packaging. Now the way to open this one, either you use a knife or a, uh, or a scissor. In my case, I would use a scissor. Now on the back, this one has four uh, plastic stickers. One at the top, one at the bottom, one in the left and one in the right. So all you have to do is just, uh, just cut them. And that should be it pretty much. So we'll just get the get the product out. Uh, between the the paper uh, the paper uh, packaging here, there is an owners uh, there is an owners owners on instructions guide, which is quite big. And of course, this will guide you on how to use the product safely and correctly. Uh, of course, this one comes with a barcode which you can scan to get the online PDF uh, format. Uh, this one can be used for a lot of uh, different reasons, to measure voltage, to measure, to measure continuity, but also to measure resistance. Personally, uh, I have used this before to check uh, if uh, the health on the battery or if there is continuity between one cable and another. But there is a lot of other reasons you would use something like that. But of course, you'll have to read the owner's instructions. Uh, to get the best out of it. Now, this one comes with the with the testing leads. So you get two of them. Which you do, those normally would uh, would be uh, would be going in their designated areas. Well, they wouldn't go unless I get the. <laughs> Uh, the plastic thing that is there holding it in place that's very odd oh there we are so there is a there is a small lid in front of them so you need to get this first out and then of course from there you'll pop them in in their designated places uh, based on what you're going to do uh, this one comes with the battery as mentioned, so let me just open that. So this is a 9 volt battery if I'm not wrong. So this is what the product uh, looks like. This is all the information here, based on the option you would like to use. You get a select and a hold button and of course there's some more technical information here at the bottom. Let me just get this out, It'll just make it easier uh, to show you guys. And then of course there's a protecting sticker, so let's get this out.
some information on the top back and then here as well now the way to install the battery in this one uh, this luckily comes with a small screwdriver so you need to get the get the screw first out and once the screw is out it doesn't doesn't want to come out there we are uh, once the screw is out uh, once the screw is loose enough uh, you should we should be able to install the battery so we put the positive pole to the positive and the negative to the negative it should be fairly simple then of course we need to uh, tie the screw again And now uh, the actual the actual uh, tester is on the off position at the moment. So if we turn it up, we should start. Uh, we should hear a beep from the looks of it. And of course, from there, based on uh, actually based on each option you change, this will make a sound. So it tell, let, lets you know that in case you, you change it by mistake, you have actually uh, went to another option. And that's it, pretty much. Uh, this is as simple as that. So this is a digital auto range multi multimeter from Parkside. Thank you for watching the video guys. Uh, do press the like button, uh, subscribe to the channel for more content and until next time stay safe and take care.